Hi guys, welcome back to Warframe. So today we're going to get the Cora Warframe pieces. Uh, we'll bring it up here in the codex. This is one of the uh, better uh, damage DPS Warframes in the game. Um, I'll put a link below to uh, top 10 Warframes that you must have and it's one of the top ones. You can see it's got uh, Whip Claw ability, Send Enemies Reeling. It's also got Ensnare which can uh, trap enemies. Got a Venari ability because this Warframe has its own Kuvat which can attack um, enemies around you. And the Strangle Dome which is uh, like a chain cage which traps enemies and causes damage. And you can actually use the first ability to whip the uh, strangle dome and cause more damage. I can see you are hungry for the knowledge of the sanctuary. So to uh, to farm this warframe, you have to go to the, the sanctuary onslaught, which is on any uh, relay. So I went to the strata relay on Earth. Are you ready? Your thirst for knowledge is as insatiable as mine. You see I've got public grouping on as well, so I've got um, an extra player's no, joined. The so the Sanctuary Onslaught mission is much easier with uh, other players. Kill everything you encounter. Do not relent. The integrity of this experiment relies on your efficiency. And the Sanctuary Onslaught will, uh, will drop all the Korra pieces with a specific chance to drop for each, uh, each of the uh, zones. I'll talk about. So you get a random location, in this case it's the uh, Grenier Earth location map. And you also get a random uh, enemy thrown at you, so in this case we've got the uh, infested. I think these are just randomly generated. The uh, Sanctuary Onslaught's got four rotations, which is A, A, B, C, and each rotation uh, has a certain reward that can be applied. So you can see uh, here, Zones 1 and 2 are um, Rotation A, and Zone 3 and 4 is also A, and then when you get to Zone 5 and 6, you're in Rotation B, and Zone 7 and 8 is Rotation C. So you can see here, um, at the end of Rotation A, which is at the end of Zone 4, you've got an 8% chance to get the Cora Chassis as a drop. Um, at the end of Zone 6, which is the end of Rotation B, you get a 9% chance for the Cora Neuroptics. And at the end of Rotation C, you get an 11% chance of the Cora Systems, or the main Cora Blueprint, dropping. So the odds aren't great, so you have to run this mission multiple times. It does take quite a while. So running this mission through to the end of Zone 6 is you know, fairly straightforward. Getting up to Zone 8 is a little bit more harder and uh, you may need to use a group or use these public groups to get, to get through to Zone 8 because it does get quite difficult. And uh, Zone 8 is where the uh, the systems and the main blueprint drops, so you need to do those. Now around each map there is a um, golden uh, swirl icon that will allow you to boost your uh, efficiency. You can see we've got to go through to the, uh, the next zone. Zone 2. So we're in a corpus ship that's been uh, damaged by the infested. 
and the enemies we're looking at are uh, corpus enemies. I don't think there's any infested enemies here, they're all just corpus enemies. Again, as I said, they're random, so... So in zone 2 we're still in the first A rotation. There's a peacekeeper. So the goal of uh, the, the Sanctuary Onslaught is to um, keep your efficiency there in the top left uh, as close to 100% as you can. And then at the end of the zone you get a, a rating, which tells you how well you did. Oh, I went down. You can hear that uh, shimmering noise, it's this golden reward that was on the ground. Pick up the golden rewards, they do boost your uh, efficiency upwards if you're trying to keep up 100%. Oh, we've got another player joint. more players, the better in this thing. Pass through to the next zone. We can find the portal. Here it is. Okay, we're on the Corpus Ice World. The experiment's design dictates increased efficiency. I trust you will be able to complete this study, Hunter. Looks like we've got uh, Cougar Elites the near enemies. There's a golden reward there. That boosted our efficiency. Usually three or four of those golden rewards around the map you can find. Golden rewards do have a, they do make a bit of a noise as well, so you can locate them by ear if you know what you're listening for. So that's the end of zone three. Our experiment moves to a new zone. 
Let's go through the zone pool. Zone 4 is the final uh, A rotation. So we'll get a chance for the uh, chassis or the neuro optics. Shield recharge. So got ten seconds left. Core chassis. Data conduit is open. Go now. Ranked A minus. That's good. Okay, we're heading towards the end of the mission. Let's see, we've got up to zone seven. Hunter, you exceed expectations. You are far more exciting and complex than any specimen in my sanctuary. The core chassis. It's good. And explore the sanctuary for new knowledge. I can see you are hungry for the knowledge of the sanctuary. Hunter, my research, your thirst for knowledge is as insatiable as mine. All right, let's go back in for another piece. Your duty in this experiment is to dispatch as many specimens as efficiently as possible. When the time comes, I will open the next data card. So I might uh, wait for another player to join. Here we go. So you can just wait in this lobby area for other players. If you want to boost your chances. Mars map. But uh, we're near enemies. Now it looks like we've got a lot of flying shields as well, which is uh, quite tricky this one. Harder to take out those um, flying shields first. So 
So the Chorus chassis that I showed you um, pretty much managed to get that on the first day, I think. Didn't take very long. The, the pieces that you'll have more trouble with are the Cora systems and the Cora main blueprint. They don't drop until rotation C or zone 8, end of zone 8. So they're much harder to achieve. So I'll skip ahead to zone 6, which is the end of rotation B. We've got infested enemies and we're on a Cuba Fortress map, I believe. I've got two other players with me, which makes it easier. See, we got the uh, your optics drop. It's very good. Open. Go now. Data conduit. Okay, I'll skip ahead to the end, which uh, we stopped on zone nine. Hunter, the sanctuary will go on without you. Optics. So that's the end of this episode guys, I hope you liked it, click like and subscribe and um, we'll see you in the next episode where we get the remaining pieces. Bye for now.